Hey, do you want a simple way to improve your health by lunchtime? Eat your breakfast. Eat your breakfast. Breakfast really is the most important meal of the day, and I'll tell you, uh, studies show that people that regularly skip breakfast are a lot more apt to get obese and something called insulin resistance, which leads to diabetes and prediabetes, than people that eat breakfast on a regular basis. Uh, there are lots of other reasons for you to eat your breakfast, and so let's talk about those. Another big breakfast benefit is that it can protect the health of your heart and your arteries. We know that people that eat breakfast regularly get less cardiovascular disease. Why, what's going on? Well, there's evidence that eating your breakfast will keep your insulin levels lower throughout the day. High insulin levels damage your arteries. The other thing is there's even some evidence that you can get a temporary bump up in your cholesterol if you skip your breakfast. So again, your heart and your arteries, arteries are the ribs of life. You want to keep them healthy, eat your breakfast. The second big breakfast benefit is it can boost your brain power. Think about it. After an overnight fast, your brain's precious fuel source, which is glucose, is like the only thing it can use, is at an all-time low because you get glucose from your food. And if you skip your breakfast, your brain is sort of like, oh, I don't have any fuel. And if your brain doesn't work, you're not going to work, right? The other thing is that it just so happens that uh, many of the foods that we tend to include at breakfast have to have a lot of nutrients that are particularly good for the brain, right? And your brain is very, very picky. It needs lots and lots of nutrients. The third big breakfast benefit is it can boost your nutrient intake. And guess what? There are 42 or more essential nutrients that your body has to have a constant daily supply of. A constant daily supply of. And think about it. If you have missed your breakfast, if you skip your breakfast, well, you know what? You have just decreased your chances of taking in some of those nutrients perhaps by as much as a third because there's only a fixed number of opportunities in the day that we can eat, right? So don't skip your breakfast. You need those nutrients. And again, the other thing is for the average American, breakfast typically provides foods uh, that have the most nutritional density, not always, but in, in general, all right? And the fourth big breakfast benefit is uh, you want to eat breakfast because guess what? It can help you lose weight, right? Food is the magic ingredient in weight loss. How does it do it? Lots of different ways. First of all, every time you eat, you get a little kick up in your metabolic rate. This, another way that it can help you lose weight is it gives you energy. If you have energy, are you more apt to move and burn calories? Yes, yes, hello, hello. The other thing is it can help keep your insulin working a little more effectively. We see that people that skip breakfast are more predisposed to insulin resistance, and that's a bad thing because it tell, turns your fat cells into fat magnets. Um, the other thing about eating breakfast is studies show that people that skip breakfast tend to eat snack and ultimately in, uh, in, um, bring in more calories throughout the rest of the day than people that take in their breakfast. So do eat your breakfast. It really is one of the most important uh, things to do. It doesn't have to be a massive breakfast. It can be small, but do eat it because guess what? You need it to be healthy, and you are the only one that can make you healthy. So take charge of your health. For ICU, this is Dr. Ann.